Hi friends, welcome to CodeJana. In this video, we are going to take a look at this application message ping from the side of developers point of view. My main motive is if you are a Python developer and you want to scale this application even further, then take a look under the hood if it is right for you. And if you want to purchase it later on, then I have wonderful plans. So right now, what are we looking at? Uh, we have a navigation bar, of course, and this is the home page that you will see if you uh, run the server. So these are the facilities that you will have with it. If you watched my earlier video uh, that was from the point of view of a customer, then you already know what these are. But let's take a quick look here. So this app can, you know, uh, send a quick message to all these four platforms. Then we can schedule a message. Then we can have contact management, full functionality here, and you can actually scale it up. Uh, I'm going to spend more time with this application because I want to start my own SaaS product here. So you can also see the potential here if you want. Uh, you can scale this application into a full-fledged contact management system, appointment system, whatever you may want. Then, of course, we have the message templates here. And uh, these are the plans that we are selling to our customers. So this is not a developer plan. Uh, developer plans will be discussed at the end of this video. So stay tuned for that. And now let's take a look at under the hood. So what you're looking at here is individual component that we have in this application. So on the surface, we have contact management system. OK, we have messaging, we have scheduling and we have templating. All right. So in VS Code, we have separate home section, contact section, message and schedule section. All right. So it will make it very easy to, you know, troubleshoot a problem and then scale this application according to your wish. Furthermore, uh, some of the really key features here are this get file path module that I have created myself and then this random generator. So this little piece of code, you can just take a screenshot here and try it yourself. With this small piece of code, we can generate any number of random string. This is particularly great if you want to generate a UID for your uh, contacts or really anything. The end represents how many characters you want in your uh, ID. So let's say we put in three here and when we run it, it will generate three character UID. Uh, actually, this is quite interesting. So let me just uh, run this. And with then we'll just provide it the value three. So new ID, let's say, and let's print that new ID. All right. So yes, so Zoe, all right. Uh, let's generate again, six zero uh, K, all right. And if you want to generate a really complex ID, let's say of eight characters, uh, wonderful. So this is a really random one. And uh, similarly, you can generate a 16 or even 60 character ID. It really depends on your choice. So, okay, let's move further because this is not the demo of this random generator. Now, let's take a look at this file path. So, uh, what we are going to use here is you can just import this search file class in any of your files here and all you have to do is just type the name of the file and it will give you a complete path the main usage is that you don't have to you know hard code the paths of any of these files like dot n file you don't have to hard code it you just have to type dot n in that uh, search file so how do we use it well that's quite interesting let's type random generator dot pi and just uh, import that class here so from apps dot uh, get file path import search file all right and then simply just say uh, file name <laughs> that's a variable so search file and then the file name so in our case let's pick anything really uh, let's say the file is requirements.txt so requirements.txt all right and then let's just print out the file name so print file name all right now we cannot run this file because it is really dependent on this apps one so what we're going to do is just we are going to import get file path directly so let's just remove this 
and let's run this file wonderful so we have get file path search file object here right and i told you we did this so that if you access the complete path here and as you can see uh, my file is currently inside c drive all the way to my project directory and then inside well message ping folder so this is the requirement of txe so the wonderful thing is you don't have to hard code any file structure and if you are porting your code to any other system or even operating system this will generate the complete path for it uh, all right so that's wonderful and i really like that this demo has gone better so again as i said that this uh, we imported this file from get file path but if you're using this in the application then make sure you type from apps dot get file path all right so okay so in our home section we have put in the code for you know basically the home page all right let me just take a look here uh, this home section the complete home section is actually powered by the home uh, well module all right so Here's the home route all right and here we are entering the template here and as you can see we have also implemented blueprint based method so that you can scale this app further if you want and uh, really this is a really big project here and i'm pretty sure that you won't be disappointed if you actually want to buy it and scale it to your liking if you want to see what we can do with this project then i highly encourage you to watch my earlier video that was from the point of view of uh, the customer as i said before but if you take a look at it you'll get the ideas of what you can do with it all right so if you have any questions any query regarding this project uh, what you will get with this then please don't hesitate to contact me via discord telegram or whatsapp the links are in the description below all right so about the plan so how much is it going to cost you all right so right now for my youtube subscribers i'm giving away this code for 60 dollars only for the usual cost of 199 dollars okay so i have divided this application into some development sections so what you're seeing in front of you it will cost you 60 dollars all right one time fee no commitment it's a lifetime license all right now with template builder that we have with us it is going to cost you $90 again one time fees all right and finally we also have a Django based version of this product that will cost you $149 the amazing thing in that version is that it will also come with user authentication so if you want to create users then obviously you will have a register function there a login function there and basically complete user management if you want to use this project right away and then start making sales start making money from this project all right so you have all the plans with you and again and all of this is currently at a discounted rate for first 100 customers only after that the 70 percent discount is going to you know reduce to like 30 40 or 50 percent discount depending on the season depending on the demand all right i really hope that you liked it and please contact me if you want to know further about it if you want a free demo also yeah contact me and uh, yeah we'll see it from there if you have stayed till now then thank you so much your support is going to help me grow and we'll grow together take care and i'll see you in the next one